The first week of August promises to be less intense than the second half of July. Thus, markets will react accordingly. Due to the regulator's summer break, the next meetings of the Federal Reserve and the European Central Bank will take place only in September. This means that the dynamics of currency pairs will depend primarily on macroeconomic indicators. For the second time since last week, the euro-dollar pair has reached the resistance level of 1.1900. However, the price failed to overcome it again. After all, it was at that level that the volume of long positions decreased and short interest increased. That is, a pullback occurred. The trading chart shows that the resistance level exerts strong pressure on buyers. Nevertheless, in order to extend losses, the price needs to fix below 1.1850. Therefore, the quotes are likely to head towards this mark. As for the pound-dollar pair, while moving upwards, it met an important psychological level at 1.4000. Thus, the price first slowed down and then pulled back. According to the current trading chart, the quote returned to the strong level of 1.3900. In order to resume its bearish run, the price needs to fix below 1.3880. Otherwise, the 1.3900 mark will return it to the area of 1.4000, acting as support. These are the two most likely scenarios. Tomorrow's macroeconomic calendar is bereft of any important releases. The lack of external factors that could affect market dynamics gives us confidence that the forecast will indeed turn out to be accurate. And that's all for now. Thank you for watching and stay tuned.